For this question, we have f of x is equal to 1 over 6x and g of x is equal to x squared minus 4x plus 3. And then we are going to evaluate f of g of negative 2. And because we're in the holiday season, I'm going to use green pen, red pen. Anyways, what does this mean? This means we have to work this out. f of and the inside is going to be g of negative 2. And then we have to do this inside out. So we have to figure out what g of negative 2 is first. Let's come to the g function, which is right here. We have to first plug in negative 2 into all these x right here. So we will get g of negative 2, which will be, I have to plug in negative 2 into this x. We have negative 2 to the second power, and then minus 4 times the x, which is negative 2. Okay, And then at the end, we have the plus 3. And now we just have to work this out. We will do the exponent first. This is negative 2 to the second power, negative 2 times negative 2. That will give us positive 4. And then here we have negative 4 times negative 2. That will give us plus 8. And then at the end, we have the plus 3. So you see, 4 plus 8 is 12. 12 plus 3 is 15. Therefore, what we are going to do is, this is going to be f of, and the inside, g of negative 2, which we know is going to be 15. So that's what we have. Well, what does it mean by f of 15? This tells us that we have to plug in 15 into this x right here for the f function. And then let's see. I'm just going to put down 1 over 6 right here. And this x is going to be the 15 that we have. So we just need to multiply 1 over 6 times 15. Well, this is the same as 15 over 6. And now, of course, we can reduce this fraction. We can divide the top by 3, so we have 5 on the top. And then we can divide the bottom by 3, so we have the 2 on the bottom. Therefore, the answer is 5 over 2. And that's it.